Fryman, the last hitter on Cito Gaston's bench. That's out of play. What would happen is the pitchers would have to hit. Fryman with a happy history against Doug Jones. Back when Jones was with Cleveland, Travis is hitting 285 for the year, 13 homers, 64 RBIs. You can put a lot of K's in the scorebook next to his name, though. He's already struck out 99 times. In the air to right, the ball really carrying tonight, but the ballpark will hold this. Gwynn makes the catch. Sierra tags. Rodriguez remains at first. Runners at the corners now with two out. And it's gone. Fryman has blasted one out of here, and the Tigers lead it 2 nothing. Travis Fryman uh, hits his 14th home run in the year. Fastball that looked like it had been up out of the strike zone. Kevin Apier has not given up a lot of home runs uh, lately. Tigers jump on the board quickly here in the first inning. For one of his own. Four nothing Tigers after that long ball. Tigers got plenty of help from the case. Bob Shalakmi Malaki. Kirk Gibson is in. Gibson would hit a two run tater later in the game. Malaki out of there. After a Juan Samuel single, Travis Fryman with the bases loaded. It is gone. The salami. Number 16 on the year. Tigers got eight in the fourth on six hits and a couple of walks. Samuel also homered in this game. And the Tigers, as they parade to the plate, win it by a 13-7 count. It's the 14th time the Tigers have reached double figures in runs. Only Texas has more double-figure games this season. Uh, Wally Jordan on the losing cause had five hits. Now, as soon as you... Can't come up with it. That's going to clear the bases. Here comes Tony Phillips. And here comes Alan Trammell with Travis Diamond ending up at third. Well, as I said, don't bet you can throw it by Travis Fryman with those quick hands all night long. In a 3-2 count, Johnson fires the fastball that is up inside belt high. You can't pitch Travis there unless you throw some really good heat and just turn so quick with those hands hitting in the upper deck. Cecil takes the first pitch outside. Gets Bob a free case of Fago and her favorite charity, Love Incorporated, will receive five free cases. That's available at Bell Push Food Center. Just a classic Tiger Stadium home run. The ball was hit very hard and high, but it didn't. You never can tell in this stadium if it's going to carry. And this ball just kept carrying and carrying. And uh, you can see the outfielder gets his back up against the wall. And there's no place to go. It's gone. Got in about the second row. Looks like the skipper, manager Phil Gardner, is going to his bullpen with this big lead, 12 to 4 for Milwaukee. The 